Thank God. The game opened. Yes. Okay. I spent like an hour opening this game, having it not respond, closing this game, having it not respond. Ugh, it was a mess. Okay. <sighs> All right. Let's load chapter. I'm kind of curious. Oh, you can like go to a level. All right. That's cool, even though it doesn't tell you where the levels are. All right. Let's, let's play. I, uh, I have a confession to make. And my confession is that I looked up the answer to this puzzle. I, I don't know why I'm so stupid. It's pretty obvious. I don't know how I managed to miss it. It's actually painfully obvious. Like, I was moving the thingy all over the place, but I didn't think to move the thingy to the place that made the most sense. So... <sighs> Dummy. Or maybe it's because it did that. Did I even try this? I don't remember. If I didn't try it, it's because I'm a dummy. All right, let's drag the box up. And we'll pull this lever now, and that should bring down the rope that we can get on top of. Easy peasy. Or it would have been easy peasy if I wasn't so fucking stupid. All right, what next? Uh... No, I can't go any higher. Can I swing? I'll swing. I think I have to swing from the bottom. So we learned in that last puzzle that was bothering us before we gave up that sometimes it takes some time to swing for a while. So let's try swinging for a while because it doesn't look like we can actually jump anywhere from here. It really doesn't. Should I swing and then, like, climb up a little bit? No, I can't climb up while I'm swinging. Can I swing from here? Am I swinging the right way? Like, this is how you do swings, right? Swing. Swing. Can I jump? What am I doing? How do I shot web? Where am I going? Feels like I'm trying to... Oh, I have an idea. Can I, like... Am I gonna have enough time if I hit this lever? Okay, there we go. Puzzle solved. Silly old Rachel. Alright, now I should be able to get over there. Is it still going? Okay, no. I was worried it was gonna go forever. There's another box, and another box. I would like to jump over those. There's a saw. Will this activate the saw? Okay. And does that activate both? How do I get the second box? Oh, it slides out over time. Alright, saw, kill me. I need to start this over again. Alright. Man, this game with the... Does this also start the saw? Whatever button you press first starts the saw. Oh, and it starts that box coming down. Come on, pull the box. Okay, alright, I got it. I figured out what I have to do. I just don't know if I'll be able to do it. So, the first button starts the saw and starts that thing coming out. And the second button drops that one. So what I have to do is start the saw, get this box, drag it over close to where that box is going to be. I don't know how I'm going to do this. Is that box get, is the saw gonna activate the button? No, it's not. Okay, I might be a little screwed. Can I jump over the saw? No. See, what I thought I had to do was activate the first button, move that box over, and then drop that box on top of the saw, and then climb on the box, and then climb up there. 
but that might not be entirely what I have to do. Maybe the first box is it's just a red herring. Or maybe I have to drop that. Oh, I get it. I think I get it. I think I have to drop. Pick up the box. Keep self hitting command when I should be hitting alt. Drop that box. Come on, come on, come on. Hurry up. No, okay, that didn't do anything. Alright, not fast enough. Uh Come on. Alright. Uh, maybe I've gotta drop the first box. And then there's some timing involved. Both buttons will start the saw. But this button starts the first box, right? And this button starts the second one. Maybe I need to start that box first. Pull this box over here. I need to stop hitting command when I need to hit alt. Have that box drop on top of this box. Can I push both boxes this way? No, I need that to not do that. Uh, it's not that I'm stumped. It's that I'm stumped. Okay. If I can survive the saw... Will I be able to move... No, because it'll destroy the boxes, and then I won't be able to get anywhere. So just using the boxes to jump over the saw doesn't work very well. But I'll try that at least. Does the saw stop? Does it come back? Alright, it comes back. So, that's not how I'm gonna... Look. That's not gonna make me live at all. Okay, kill me. Uh, I have no idea! Do I just have to be really fast? Like, fast enough to grab that box? Let's we'll start that one, because this one's almost at the bottom. Fast enough to grab this box. Find the boxes, and then jump. Yeah, I think I have to move that box closer. Let's give that a shot. I want to start that box. I'm gonna get to a decently reasonable. Drag that box over here. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Yeah, got it. Finally. I've started running a timer while I record so that I don't record episodes that are really long since I'm bad at telling time. So let's see if it helps. Uh, darkness. I always want to check out the darkness before I take the ladder. But, am I going anywhere? Where am I? I can't see anything. I don't know where I am, but I don't like it. I'm out. I'm spooked. It's broad daylight. Lights are all on, and I'm spooked out of my mind. That's what this game is supposed to be doing to me. Not befuddling me with stupid puzzles. Alright, down we go. That's a really nasty looking bug. Is it gonna kill me? No. Can I get back up that hill? Okay, I'm trapped down here. What do I do? That bugs with its food. 
What's it doing? Is it just gonna sit there? Do I have to go really fast? Gotta go fast. Can I jump in its food? And make it eat me? I must be covered in its filth now. You gonna eat me, bug? I don't want to be trapped down here. I think I should have kept going in the darkness. What happens if I load the last chapter? Where do I start if I load here? Okay, I start up here. Which means I can go down, back into the darkness. But it doesn't seem like I want to go back down into the darkness. It seems like I want to do something with that bug. But what can I do with the bug? Can I do anything here with this ladder? Alt, 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 alt spam. No. Why did this game get hard? I was having such a good time with this game. Okay, bug. Maybe I have to sneak, creep up on it slowly? Try that. It's okay. No. Let's try it again. That might not be the answer. Let's see, like, when I'm tromping through the water, he's gone by, like, there. And I was able to get much closer to him than normal. That bug freaks me the fuck out. I don't like that bug. So we can go at a normal speed until we get, like, here. Until he starts lifting his head up. I think that's the clue. He lifts his head up, and he looks at me funny. And there's a really nice glare coming from my window. It's impairing my vision. I'm just tapping left very lightly. No! What am I supposed to be doing? I was barely moving. I was doing the same little bit of moving. I'm spamming alt over its food and I'm not getting anything. Spamming alt underneath it, nothing. Jumping. I really think that's the solution. I've got to get the bugs somehow. But I can't seem to get there. I'm barely tapping the button. Just quick tap, release, tap, release, tap. I'll start spamming alt while I do. Every time I move, I'll hit alt. Just in case there's something I'm meant to be doing. Nothing. Nothing. Still nothing. Still nothing! What the bejesus? Uh, if every single... Ga if every single episode's gonna be like this, I'm looking at the bug. Is the direction I look a hint? If it is, that's a really cool game mechanic that I never noticed. Oh, he went higher that time. He went higher on the wall that time. Maybe I have to keep scaring him? He didn't just go back to the same place. He went higher on the wall. Now he's low on the wall. Did, was I just not noticing him go higher on the wall and he goes higher than lower?
I'm hitting alt, and nothing's happening. I would think something would happen. Right, he goes higher on the wall that time. Is there something I can do or grab while he's higher on the wall? Is there some kind of switch? Can I go through? Can I grab something? Can I go up something? <sighs> when did this game get so hard? I don't like it. This game used to be simple. Like, the puzzles were complicated, but I used to see the answer. Now I'm just not seeing the answer. And this bug is creeping me out. Do I- maybe I just stand here for a little while. Let's see what happens if I stand here. Maybe I can talk to you guys for a bit while we're standing here. Let's talk about puzzle games. About time puzzles. No, we've talked about time puzzles and how much I don't like them before. Uh, what could we talk about? Is it moving? Is it coming down? Is it gonna come down if I just stand here? It's moving its leg. But it doesn't seem to actually be moving down the wall. And it doesn't react to me being down here. You'd think it would. You know what? Let's go down into the darkness. As spooky as it was, and as much as I didn't like it. We'll go in the darkness and see if there's anything of import down there. I don't like the dark- like, legitimately my screen is black. Like, I know YouTube makes things darker, but my screen is black. I don't see anything. I hear some water. I'm not moving anymore. Up. Up. I'm on something. Walking. There's a light. Achievement! Alone in the dark. Oh, I got an achievement. Okay. What's this place? Can I grab any of these? They look cool. Can I pull this? No, I can't push it. It looks like it's supposed to go up somehow. Alright. I got an achievement, which helped me 0%. It's kind of pretty down here. Really pretty, but prettiness doesn't make me feel any better about not having any idea how to solve this puzzle. Sadly. I wish it did. I wish that had been a solution and not just an achievement. I guess I could have known from the fact that it started me up there that there was nothing of import down here, but I was hopeful. It's very hopeful. Alright. Oh! Didn't mean to do that. Cool for you, Danny. I can't play Neverwinter because it doesn't have a Mac wrapper. Alright, back here with the bug. So I can't get to the bug, and if I can, I'm doing it wrong. I'm stopping every time you put the set up. Tapping ever so lightly. Oh, nothing. Moves away. I don't know what to do. I have no idea what to do. Ah. Completely stumped. So what you're telling me is I've solved two puzzles in this episode, and one of them I had to look up the answer to. And it'll probably be the same in the next episode, because I'm definitely going to look up the answer to this. <sighs> I'm spamming all everywhere, and there's nothing I can pick up. Nothing I can move. Nothing I can grab onto. Can't grab the bug, because I can't get close enough, and I do spam alt when I get close to the bug. But I cannot interact with it. I'm really hoping I just have to get through a bunch of stupid puzzles, and then they become clear again. Alt. 
Maybe I have to stand here for a little while while it gets used to me? Don't fly away, bug. I need you to fly me up. Wait, can I grab onto its legs? No. Dang. I thought maybe I could grab its legs. And then it would fly me up there. But that clearly was not the solution. Or maybe I just moved too fast. Maybe if I keep moving slowly it won't fly up so fast? I don't remember. Let's try that again. I did it! Look, guys! Finally! Ah! Fucker! Ah, okay. Now I'm actually gonna sign out. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Wait, I'm gonna check and make sure that this is a new chapter. No, okay, I wanna get to wherever a new chapter is so that it loads me from there next time. Let's walk a little. New chapter yet? Okay, yeah. Right? Right, okay, we're in a new chapter. Now I can safely leave. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.